Hello guys, welcome to my channel TechSpace and here we will see the Nifty and Bank Nifty analysis for 21st of July 2022. So today Nifty opened gap up and Bank Nifty as well opened gap up and then for most of the day it was mainly consolidation. Uh, I'm not sure how many of you would have made some uh, profits but uh, it was just a scalping market where uh, in this direction you had to scalp 10-20 points and then again downwards 10 20 points from the top so basically you had a very good run since last two days and so market uh, was consolidating today so for tomorrow we will see uh, how market can behave uh, due to uh, the global queues and domestic queues um, uh, for, uh, moreover if we see at stock futures uh, so us is like uh, trading flat and nasdaq has uh, you know got a good run uh, towards the upside and uh, nifty uh, 50 futures is also trading flat in the sgx uh, index so basically it's uh, some of the europe news may move the market like uh, milan's uh, uh, italy's uh, government decision and all is moving the market and trade decision uh, is going on and also some profit booking might happen because the market has been uh, on the upper side for last two to three days so based on that uh, we i am providing some levels to you for, so for tomorrow in nifty if nifty breaks on the upside if it breaks 16585 then it can move towards 16644 and if it breaks 16644 then the next target would be 16701 so on the downside if nifty breaks 16,480, then you can see a target of 16,420. And if it breaks 16,420, then you can directly see 16,366. This is for Nifty. And uh, this, and for Bank Nifty, we will see. So Bank Nifty was the same. Uh, it opened gap up. And then for most of the day, it was consolidation. We can see it as a flat day and you could have got some chance in scalping. Uh, but that was not a good trending day uh, tomorrow uh, there is expiry as well and we might see a trending day uh, but as far as targets are concerned we will uh, take some minimal uh, considerations so if Nif bank nifty breaks 36 181 on the upper side we can see a target of 36 280 and if it breaks that we can see a target of 36 380 and on the downside if it breaks today's low then you can see a target of 35760 around and then if that breaks first target then the second target would be 35640 uh, considering the open interest tomorrow is the ex weekly expiry and uh, the, the, there have been a lot of put additions in uh, 16500 so it will act as a good support and if it if for some reason there is gap up or gap down then we might see uh, really see a trending day trending day uh, and the call open interest have been added in 16600 so market may remain in a range bound uh, we cannot say because uh, there, there is a good support on the downside and good resistance on the upper side for bank similarly for bank nifty there have been massive call writing in 36000 uh, considering the put writing and also today put writing have been added in 36000 so tomorrow uh, if there is a major gap up or gap down, then we might see a trending day towards that side. Uh, so that's all for now. A small uh, disclaimer uh, before ending my video. So do watch the video and if you like it, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.